What name is given to the point in the celestial sphere directly above an observer? A, Zenith, B, Nadir, or C, Azimuth? You've put Zenith. Yeah. It's the only word I actually recognised out of those three words that are up there. Zenith is the only thing I've ever heard of, so I didn't know the answer, so if I know the words, I'll, I'll pick it. Correct answer is... Well played, Zenith's right, step close to home. Chase has foot. <laughs> Goes right with Zenith. Here's next question. What spice was once called Indian saffron because of its orange-yellow colour? A. Cardamom. B. Nutmeg. C. Turmeric. You've put... Cardamom. I like to put a bit down my curries. It's one of my favourite spices. <laughs> so, again... I don't know the answer, but um, I, it's something that's close to my heart of curry, so I'll go with cardamom. The correct answer is... It's turmeric, you're staying where you are. Chaser has put... Goes right with turmeric, moves to within two with four from home. Here's the next question. What Second World War gun manufactured in Enfield was invented by Major R.V. Shepard and H.J. Turpin? A. Sten gun. B, the Bren gun. C, the Tommy gun. You've put... Yeah. Uh, the Tommy gun. The, yeah, the Tommy gun. Again, it's a difficult one, but it's the only one that made sense to me. Correct answer is... It's the Sten gun. You're staying where you are. Um, Chaser has put... Goes with Sten. Moves within one with four from home. The Tommy gun was invented by a man called Thompson. And the Bren gun was invented in a place called Bruno, spelt B-R-N-O, in the Czech Republic. Thank you. Here's your next question. Good luck. We need it. We're in trouble already. Here we go. He's on form. Why was Madonna banned from returning to an American cinema chain in 2013? A. Bringing her own food. B. Throwing popcorn. Or C. Texting. You've put... Texting. Yeah, it's the, probably the most annoying thing that happens in cinema these days. And uh, I, can't, um, I can imagine her using her phone a lot. I don't think she'd bring her own food because she could buy her own food. And I think she's probably a little bit old for throwing popcorn. So I'm going to go with texting as a logical answer. You've put text in. Correct answer is... That's a well played. Oof, All right, step close home. Chaser has put... Also goes with texting. Here's next question. Who was the only person to both score and be booked in the 1966 World Cup final? A. Jeff Hurst. B. Wolfgang Weber. C. Martin Peters. You've put... Jeff Hurst. Yeah, well, and obviously, now I know he scored. Um, I don't know if he got booked or not. I think they all scored, to be honest with you, as far as I can remember. I think they all did, but... I think Jeff first, I just he might as well throw him a yellow card. He's having a good game. I'm sure he wasn't bothered taking a yellow card to the team. So gotta be right, he'll know this. Know. Correct answer is Martin Peters is the right answer. Staying where you are. Now the chaser has put. He'll know this. I know. Go right, Martin Peters uh, takes us out three from home. I watched the World Cup final at least over 30 times. If it was an Irish question about the Irish football team, I would have known, but then we'd never get to the World Cup final. <laughs> no, indeed. <laughs> However, Barry, I'm sorry you have been caught. View the chase, Thank mate, you. is over. Cheers, Great seeing you. Thank Cheers, you. mate. Thank Good you. luck. Thank you.